What's up guys, it's Crazy K here and welcome to or welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new here, hi, I'm Crazy K. I do lifestyle, beauty, travel and you should subscribe to my channel. I think you should. But after this video, you can decide. I won't force you. But today, I'm going to be showing you guys how I do my lash extensions at home and baby, they look just like the real thing. You can't tell me that I didn't go and get my lashes done. You can't tell me that I did not sit in a chair for two hours to get my lashes done. Because them last year, oh my god, oh my god, oh my eye, dolly down. What's dolly? Dolly down. $10,000 set. $10,000 volume. Volume hybrid. $10,000 hybrid, my peer. Yeah. Professional lash tech. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to be showing you guys how i do my lashes at home by myself by the on a budget episode two like what are you dumb by the on a budget episode two and we're coming we're coming with it this is for the baddies this is for the baddies 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 baddies, baddies, baddies. be normal <sighs> anyways so for this look you're gonna need a few things a few things okay so starting off strong, the main thing you need, this not do good, this not fix good, wait there, I'm gonna fix it, I'm gonna fix it. I already fixed now, wait there, let me see, 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 this right here, the holy grail. Here. If you you need this, if you want to do this look, you need this. So go on Amazon and go buy it. It's only nine dollars. It's literally nine dollars. You're paying nine dollars for a ten thousand dollar look. Come on, come on. And the next thing you need are some falsies, like some cheap, 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 cheap false lash. You don't need for spend one thousand dollar for a false eyelash. But I know all people spend one thousand dollar for a false eyelash. Where you spend one thousand dollar for a false eyelash for? I just see and take it out, you know. Anyways, I have two. I have this one from Shein, which is long. It's too long, so I'm pairing it with these short, cheap ones. The two of them cheap, like 500 feet for them. So yeah. I also need a lash curler. This I like one dollar Shein. You see me? I tell me. I put on one dollar pan Shein. One dollar, two dollars on Shein. The most probably, probably. Scissors to cut the lashes because they are lash strips and you don't want to put the whole lash strip on your eye. So scissors, um, a spoolie to brush out the lashes, and a tweezer to put on the lash. I don't, I don't think I'm going to use this, but we might. But who, who knows? So, without further ado, don't forget to subscribe and like the video and comment on the video. Thank you, and let's get into the video. All right. So we're gonna start off at the end of the lashes because really and truly we don't need lashes in the corner of our eyes. Like it's itchy. I don't put it directly on the end and I don't put it directly in the corner. So I'm gonna cut the strip. I'm gonna cut the strip. So cutting off the tail end because we don't need that. And then I'm just going to cut it like in big pieces. Like, you know, uh, like when I say big pieces, I mean like. Oh, wait, gone. So, a piece, you're going to start off with a piece big like this. Like, I think this is big compared to what I've seen the other girls to use. But yeah, piece like that, and then you're going to use the bond side of the false car. Open it, and because you want to apply it on the lashes, so it's going to look like it's going to go up like this. So you're going to apply it inside. Hold on, yeah, you're gonna apply it on the inside like this. You have to make sure product is on there because you want it to stick. Yes. Right. And then put it on. 
I just put it on the base and then just go like so you have to you have to do like this like if a pay I just stick it stick it After this, this shot, this alone can't go work. This alone can't go work. This look like my eyelash. All right, I applied the first one. It does not make a difference. Like it doesn't look. Yeah, no. So I'm going to down and use these long ones. Cut them little. This is how the first lash is looking. So I'm gonna show you guys a close up now of how to put the bond on the lash. So that's the stripper lash, that's the size that I put on my lash. And then you use the bond side of the false cara and just take it out to get a generous amount of it. And then you put it on the lash. Now I stick the lashes onto my lashes so I focus more on the top portion of the lash and put like a little on the band because I don't really like to stick the band on my lid. So that's what I do. And now I'm sticking it onto my eyes, but you need a tweezer. Please use a tweezer. Don't don't be like me here. Don't be like me. Like when you when you advance, you can use your hands. But for the most part, just use a tweezer. But me use my hand and it go on good. Period. Like like as a pro, as a pro, yeah. Talk truth. All right. So finished one eye. How am I looking? I had to do it off camera because baby, I lost the gist. I lost the gist. I'm not even going to lie to y'all. But I got it back. I got it back. So, first things first, you get the lash, right? You cut the strip of lash. I showed you guys that my hand is messy because I have to be doing this. So, I put the bond on the lash itself and not on my lash because the last time I did that, it didn't turn out good for both of us, for the lash or, or me. So, yeah. Use the tweezer, take out the lash. See, I just told you guys use the tweezer. Don't use your hand, don't be like me. Use the tweezer, that's how it's looking. And then we're gonna stick it on to our eyelids. It's gonna take a while. And, oh, it took quick, okay. It did that quick. That that was good, that was good. Go on with yourself, girl. Period. And then we're just moving on to the next. On to the next one. Like, nothing. Like, it's nothing to us. It's very regular so put on the bun on the lash then just you know get the tweezer girl get the tweezer yeah and then just clip it on to her eyelids and as i said you want to stick it under your lash stick it to your lash don't put it on the bun because it's itchy it's gonna itch you it's gonna irritate you so just follow my advice and you you'll be fine so see there two lashes on let's go period 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 
period. I'm just gonna check out myself. I look at myself. I look at my eye. I'll show you guys how it looks. It looks different. It looks weird. I was thinking it looks weird, but I'm gonna put do it over. So I'm just continue. Go to our next trip. Oh, I have to trim up the lash because I'm not you guys. The lash is long. I'm. I don't want them long, 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 long. I don't want them touching my eyebrows. I just want a little, a little more length. So, put on the bun, do it again, repeat process, and I'm showing you guys like how oh, to stick it under your eyelid now. So see there, me show, me try, me try be close, me try be. You get me? So. And there I just stick it, stick the lash up there on the eyelash and then press it down. So you press it down to make sure that it's sticking to your eyelash. People when you don't go and drag out the eyelash when you feel irritated. Like when it's irritating you don't drag it out because as I said you're sticking it to your eyelash. Which means that if you drag out the lash you're dragging out your eyelashes. So just yeah don't do that but stick it to your eyelashes that's the 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 most comfortable way to me at least and i'm repeating the process again so y'all can just watch that close personal Look, 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 tears are shed. Yeah, tears, tears are gonna shed, man. Cause I, what I did this time, all the other clips, the previous clips that you guys were seeing, I was quenching my eyes. So this time I tried to keep my eyes open, and because of that, I shed a little tear. But that's fine. That's normal. My eyelashes together again to just make sure that they're secure, secure. And then I want to take a look at myself. So. May I, may I take out the camera and look and see how I look like up close and personal. One eyelash is different than one. I realize that now, but eyelash are sister though. Yeah. Alright, eyebrow. I don't know what eyebrow. Anyways, I'm taking the sealant. If you don't know other thing you want to do, do this. Because the sealant, this is the sealant. You need the sealant on your eyelashes. It's going to prevent it from falling off for weeks. Trust me, you need the sealant. It, it make your lashes waterproof all of that put the sealant where you put the bond so right on the lot where you think your lash stop stop with the sealant right there and i do that on top of my eyelashes and on the like below my eyelashes to make sure that it seals all right so this is how we're looking so far yeah and yeah you couldn't tell you couldn't tell tell the truth tell the truth it's a little sparse is it sparse I don't want it to give volume though. I don't want it to give volume. I just want a little extra length on my lashes. So I'm gonna just cut the inner inner something. It cut. I cut my lashes. I need to brush. I need to brush this off. I'm gonna get my spoolie and just comb it out because let me tell you guys, it can't comb out and I add him something unless you seal it. So the last thing that you saw me do was seal it. You have to seal it because the sealant is what like makes the lashes really stick. Like the bun makes it stick, but the sealant like make it stay. If that makes sense, so you can just comb it out like you would with regular false lashes. 
me that try to go for like a cat eye look. It's why right here, but over here don't look like cat eye. I'm going to try to cut it for shape it like that. So this is how it's looking. When you can't tell me, say, when you can't look for me and tell me, say, this is not, this is not fast. Alright, so now I'm going to take my lash curl up and just get a look a curl, you know, look a curl. Oh. <laughs> just stick to my bottom lash. Alright, so I'm do the same thing. Oh god. Ah. Uh, we at them free. <laughs> this longer than the other one or something. Call why this hard pugaina. Hard pugaina. Why it hurts. Okay. Alright. Lashes are curled. Come to the go. Uh huh. And as I said, I don't put any in the corners of my lashes just because they they like me drag them out. I will drag them out. So not trying to do that. So yeah. I feel like this bit is longer than this bit though. But yeah, there's the lashes. Alright so guys, we reached at the end of this video. Y'all like the lashes? I like them. Like honestly, I just want more length. Like if my lashes were like long like this, I wouldn't need lashes. Probably they would be long if I wore mascara. So I'll try that. But yeah, this is how we're looking. It's giving fuzz. Look there. When I see my lash under there, so tell me. Tell me the truth. Tell the truth. Where there? What is it on? So this is how it looks like on the, the line. I don't put it on my lash line. I just put it right where my eyelash them start grow. I don't put it on my eyelid on the pink part. Don't do that. So you see? Yeah, I don't put it on the pink part because last time, last time I did that, I felt like I was going to go blind. Don't do that. But yeah, this, this is fairly easy. It takes like the people on TikTok say take them 10 minutes. This took me like half an hour. Took me like half an hour. Because I had to get the gist of it. When you're doing it, like if you're doing the technique that I do, when you put the the bond on the lash, put it on and make sure that the lash sticks to your lash because that's really what you want. You're not trying to stick the band onto your eyelid really. You're trying to stick your lashes, the lashes together so that they can stick together yeah but yeah that's really it that's really it you just put it on put it on your eyelash and stick it together it's going to be hard to stick together because it may stick to your hands but it will stick together stick it together and then you let it dry and then you put the sealant over it and that's it like that's it so it can take 10 minutes if you're good at it but i yeah yeah and kept so yeah but that's it for today's video don't forget to like comment share and subscribe to my channel and bye i'll see you guys on the next body on the episode you guys what do i want to see for the episode like what do i want what do i want like things other than here I'm not showing the things other than here. Like it's not just gonna be here. It's gonna be hair, nails, like beauty overall, and a bit of lifestyle too. So stay tuned for the next body on the episode and the next video. Bye.